how to set the default programming language or the default language inside notepad plus plus in windows 10 so let's open notepad plus plus and when we open notepad plus plus and if you double click on this bar over here it will create a new file and if you scroll down to the bottom over here it will say normal text file it means that we are currently working on a .txt file format and if you save this file it will be saved on a .txt file format so let's go to file and let's go to save as and it says save as type normal text file and you can choose a various other file formats from here we don't want to do that all right we want our desired programming language set as default when we open notepad plus plus or when we create a new file in notepad plus plus to do that we need to go to settings and select preferences and here we have various options on the left hand sidebar so we need to go to new document inside of new document here we can see uh, different options like default language is non and it's a normal text so we can click here and we can select the programming language of our choice so let's say i want to work on the html document all the time so i'm going to scroll down and find html and i'm going to click on html then i can also check this box that says always open a new document in edition 8 startup so you will always open a new document while i launch notepad plus plus so i'm going to close this i'm going to double click here this will basically create a new file inside notepad plus plus so i'm going to exit out of the old one and at the bottom you can see the file type is hypertext markup language this is a generally a html file and now i can start working on html files uh, whenever i create a new file directly and similarly you can change that to any other file type you want such as html and we got uh, c c sharp c plus uh, maybe I don't know different other options here so that's how we change the default programming language or the default language inside notepad plus plus thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video